Hello everyone, today I want to share with you what, what I have learned about setting billboards. So, what will be in this video? First, what is a billboard? And I will sh show you that there are four classes reference to billboard, the difference between billboard and billboard graphics, we will go to business uh, micro example in VS Code, and after the detailed explanation about all properties of billboard using send custom. Now, so what is it, is a billboard? In Cesium, it's type of an image or an icon, as you see here in the picture. We see here it's Cesium and the logo of this, but you see it's just an image. But in the real world, the billboard, uh, this is how it looks like. Now, the difference between billboard and billboard graphics, I put here a picture of the documentation. So we see that billboard uh, need to be inside of billboard collection while billboard, billboard graphics are inside the entity okay the so four classes reference to billboard are billboard 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 collection billboard graphics and billboard visualizer which i won't explain about it now let's go to this code so here i will i create a simple uh, html file here in the script I use it says JS, link to widget CSS, okay, a simple div uh, with ID of Cesium container in the script. I create a viewer of Cesium. Now how we create a billboard a graphics, it's a just var entity and add. We, uh, we create a add, we create a new entity. And the entity we the position from degrees and here billboard and the object which have has a image height and width. Now to create a collection, it's also it's very simple. We uh, we write var billboards view a same primitive add create a billboard collection, and now we can use the function add and uh, write the an object with position, image height and width. After this, we tell the viewer to zoom to the first entity. Now. Uh, the question is, what is the height and width here? So, first, the, this is my uh, directory of uh, the project. Well, let's uh, go into assets, image, and this is a picture. And now, if I go to properties, details, you see it's uh, two, 200 uh, pixels. And uh, it says you work with pixels, and so 200 pixels will will cover all the globe, so I need to to put something less than this. So I write a uh, 30, and you will see now how it works. Now, I have already r run the, this HTML, and uh, you see in in the in the past a project billboards, but uh, nothing you see here. What's the problem? We see here that the problem is cross origin data, etc. etc. So you can read about this later. And so, what we need to do, we need to not just uh, double click on this HTML file, but to run, uh, execute him from a server. So, how we do, do this? We just need a simple HTML, uh, HTTP server. So, you can in VS Code open with the live server. This is what I already done. And great, we see our uh, three billboards. Here is a, is Israel, and uh, we can uh, zoom to him. And uh, great, okay, that's all. Now, uh, so this what this uh, simple uh, code do. Now, let's go a little deeper, and I want to explain to you all the properties of uh, billboards as you see there are a lot of them and uh, it's easier to understand them using the the, the, the zoom send custom so when you open the billboards on on send castle you see on the left uh, side a bunch of code and you don't know from where to start and uh, on the right side you see the globe the billboard and the combo box with a lot of uh, a lot of options so let's uh, f we will cover uh, every every option here okay so the first option add a billboard now you see here in 
on the left side there a green icon which shows that this what executed now so the, so what we see the again what we create here we create an entity and inside an entity we create a billboard so this is called a uh, you can see also entity dot billboard if I uh, click on it wait a second and you see it's a billboard graphics as I told you before now um, okay and that's the image okay very simple that's a first simple example now let's go and uh, go deeper okay we see that uh, now the, bill the billboard looks a lot of different what different so what are the options okay image we understand the image show okay it's simple just a uh, true or false to show the billboard or not to show and the pixel offset the question is offset from from what okay the answer is offset in this example from the entity position this is a entity position and we take an offset of 50 pixels or 50 uh, uh, okay uh, 50 pixel up okay because how it works Cartesian uh, 2 it's on the it works and uh, this is the x axis and this is the y axis so uh, so 50 it means up now uh, you can see also uh, he, we were we were here and now take a 50 pixel up and we stand here Okay, I offsets. It's uh, a little complicated to uh, to explain it, but uh, let's try. Okay, now uh, while it's open, it I maybe I uh, open something else. Um, okay, horizontal origin. What is horizontal origin? Um, it's very simple. You see, we see here an entity with an label with a label, and the yellow here is a billboard. So, uh, so when I tell to horizontal origin uh, that right means it, the billboard will be right to the label, center, center, and left, left to the to the label. Because here I, in the entity, I can I won't do this now, but I can also add it to the entity that will have a label. Okay, vertical origin. It's uh, it's. It just will be so bottom up and uh, etc. Okay, what is scale? Scale means multiply the size of uh, the of the billboard of the billboard. Okay, when it's higher than one, it will uh, make the billboard bigger. But when it's less than one, it will uh, decrease him. Okay, and uh, I can show you here. I will do this one second just for you to see uh, run one second and you see is that now the label is very small uh, next okay rotation and aligned axis there go uh, together aligned axis is a uh, is a unit vector unit vector I just uh, remind you a unit vector it's for example one uh, uh, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, and uh, etc. I really don't 100% uh, understand how it works, but now the rotation, they use this uh, uh, unit vector and make a rotation. The rotation here, it's uh, pi over 4. Pi over 4, if you don't remember, you can also just press uh, once and see uh, what is what does it mean. So, one second i don't know why but the internet is a little bit uh, uh, slow it means pi divided by four pi is uh, 180 degrees divided by four 45 degrees and you see here it's on 45 degrees okay a uh, color line it's a uh, some type of green and uh, okay now about i offset i offset uh, it's about I coordinates. What is I coordinates? You ask. So I coordinates. Here's an example uh, explanation in the documentation. X it's point to the viewer uh, to the viewer right. Y points up and Z points into the screen. So here we see that uh, the, the 
that x axis and z, and z axis are zero, but y axis have a, a eight millions. So it uh, you, and we see that it up to the globe, as it uh, tells why it points up. Okay, I really don't know when to use it, but this is what, uh, what it does. And uh, next example, it's chain billboard properties. Uh, okay, this is very, very simple. Okay, position, okay, billboard, take an image, uh, scale it by uh, 3, multiply by 3, and with alpha, it's, uh, tran it's uh, transparent, it. you see it's uh, uh, transparent. <laughs> now, uh, okay, size billboard, what, what it is, it's the just make the size in meters. Uh, okay, you see, now I zoom out. You see that it's very small because uh, the default is that the picture, the image will be on pixels, but now it will be in uh, meters. Next, add multiple uh, uh, billboards. Okay, how is this? Okay, so we just three times make uh, to the entities an uh, add function and uh, nothing more. Uh, next, scale by viewer distance. Okay, you see the the billboard looks very very far from us, but when we zoom uh, zoom in, then the uh, the billboard is bigger. Okay, so how it, uh, how it does it work? It, we use the scale by position property. Okay, he, it uses the the value of near far scalar. Okay, so that the the two these two are near and the other two are far uh, so when we near uh, to the billboard multiply it by two when we far from the billboard multiply it by uh, by uh, it means divide by two okay what the, what is far and what is near here we uh, we we, put, we write it this this for example is uh, 15, uh, 1500 meters. Okay, next, fade by viewer distance. How does this uh, work? Okay, I selected the billboard and why it doesn't work? One second, I will refresh it. One second, maybe I will close something to help it. And two seconds. Fed by viewer. Okay, again I selected it, and it uh, on some point it it faded, it disappeared. Okay, and then it uh, returns. Okay, so how does it work? Let's see. You just use that translate. It's a. Uh, uh, it's all, it's mean, um, I forget now. <laughs> okay, you can see this uh, after, but it, it works on the same uh, like before, near far scalar. Okay, when we, when we near, uh, uh, one second, one second. Yes, translucency, it's like transparent, okay? Uh, it, it changes it, uh, not, not the size, okay, we not scale it but with tr the transparent change okay so when we got to this value we uh, you see you see the change of the transparent now we uh, now it's uh, you see it now less okay i'm sorry for for my english <laughs> offset okay what it is you see there also here if we zoom in also it says uh, there are one image, okay, billboard, and one more billboard. But when we we are in, in big distance from from them, we don't see this. Okay, this is this example used two things. Okay, uh, we twice make an add function uh, from degrees. But look at something interesting. There are both are on a, on the same location, but they are not one. On the other, there are a difference between them. So how they did it? Um, the first one, the 
not the logo, the Mega Horizontal Origin Center, you see the, in the center of the entity, and the second also in the center, okay, great. Uh, the Vertical Origin, it's not necessary really, you can uh, put in on comment. What uh, uh, really matter, it's a pixel offset. The Cesium logo uh, taken offset from the, from this uh, from this one, and uh, again it uses pixel offset scale by distance. So now we don't see it, and also transparency. So when we come closer, we see it better. Okay, and that's all. Add marker billboards. Okay, uh, okay, a very cool billboards which are marker and uh, it's also simple. Let's take an image, make a color, and what is, and the, there is also property image sub region. What does it mean? It take a simple a region of the image, not all the all not all the picture, not all the image, and uh, so to understand it better. I cloned the, uh, to my computer the Cesium project. Okay, and uh, now let's see what is white shapes P PNG. Okay, one second, one second. I, I don't know if you see it's uh, good, but it's a picture of a lot of icons. Okay, one second. And uh, the image subregion just Take every time as one of them, make a rectangle um, which bounds them. Okay, uh, that's all. Very simple. So, and because it's a white, you can simply color it. And the last, disable the depth. This is I don't 100% understand this uh, example. Uh, one second, it's very, very slow in my computer. Okay, now what's happened here? Here we provide a terrain. Terrain is not an image of the earth, but the, how it actually looks. Okay, you see that the, here is a mountain. Okay, so we provide a terrain, we create a world, a world terrain. And there is depth test against terrain. I'm not absolutely understand it, but now the property we add here disable test uh, distance. If you uh, see look at the doc documentation, it seems that it's disable this. So something here strange to me. I don't understand it uh, 100%. What uh, really matter here? It's the height reference. Uh, okay, and here it clump to ground. When I will zoom in, it looks. Uh, one second. It looks like the uh, the billboard is sitting on the on this mountain. So this means clump to ground, and uh, that's all. That's all. So thank you very much, and uh, yeah, you can see. Yeah.